All right, everybody. Today we're going to be doing a review on the Acer Nitro. It's an i5 computer. So this is the Acer Nitro i5 computer. Now, they have one that has a GTX 1650 video card in it, and this is the one. And they have another one that has the same card, but it's a TI card, a GTX 1650 TI. This thing is an awesome gaming laptop. It has played everything, every single game that I've thrown at it without lag. So let's get right into it. <clears throat> so the top is like a uh, uh, plastic, but it, it feels you know good quality. And then the back, because the laptops put out a lot of heat because they're gaming laptops, notice it has the uh, nitro. See how, let's see if I can show you. It has like the little nitro logo there. And then on the side, we have uh, the two USB ports. And then this is where your ethernet cable for your internet goes in. And then it has the HDMI port and then like the lock if you want to lock it to your desk or something like that. Let's take a look at the back. The back has these huge air ports here for the heat to come out of. Flipping it around here on the bottom. It's very easy to take off. I added more memory so I was able to, you know, just snap some memory on there. So this comes with eight RAM, eight gigabyte RAM. So I added uh, 16. So now I have 24 uh, gigabyte RAM <clears throat> and the thing just runs like a beast. It's awesome. So on the other side, I'll show you here. Notice um, we have another USB port and then a microphone to the left of that. And then this is where the power adapter goes in. More heat vents. So one of the things that, um, <clears throat> excuse me, one of the things that really impressed me was the startup of it so you have a very easy button here to press usually you know the laptops will have these little sliders here you just press that it's a light up keyboard so let me go shut the lights off to show you let me turn the light up keyboard on there we go kind of have a lot of light in here still but let's go back to this here. and now I'll show you two things that make this one of the best gaming laptops uh, ever okay we're gonna log in okay so we're logged into the computer and I'm gonna show you two features that are really good so first of all there's what's called Acer Nitro Sense, and it's loading right now. <clears throat> now notice, this is the speed of the fans right here. These are the speed of the fans. So what you can do when you're gaming, you can put it on max fan and watch, you'll really hear it. Um, and another thing is you have what's called Cool Boost. This is the Acer Nitro 5's Cool Boost system where it helps to keep the laptop cool. So it is powerful, but not where it would interrupt, you know, your gaming. Now, another thing which I really like, notice you have Acer Network Optimizer, right there, that middle icon. So when you click this, check this out. Right when your game's loading, you gotta, excuse me, I have allergies. Right when your game's loading, you'll see your game within here. And what you'll do is you'll click this, see how it's going from five, four, three, two, you just boost that sucker up to six. And then like, let's say for example, you're playing uh, Call of Duty Modern Warfare, you'll, you'll see it in here, the EXE file loading, and you just click that. And um, you know what, why don't I, well, I was gonna show you, but it, it'll take too long to load it. But for example, Here's a game called Squad, which is a great game. So when I load that, 
I won't do it right now, but it'll show squad here. And then I can actually optimize the network to where it plays with, you know, virtually, well, I'm going to say zero lag whatsoever. So it's a great laptop computer. I have had absolutely no problems with it. I would suggest just getting some more memory. It's real cheap. Um, when I first got it, I did have some issues with it where it would just lag a little bit in game, but very easy. Just snap in that um, memory. You know, you can get memory real cheap on the internet. You snap it in there, and this thing will uh, even go up to 32 gigs of RAM. You can put two 16 uh, memory cards in there, 16 gigabyte, you know, memory cards. So I have a 24. Let me show you something. We're going to go to system over here. <clears throat> so go down here. Notice we have 24. Let's see if I can show that to you. Right here, 24 gigabyte RAM. Right there. And um, it comes with, uh, let's go to the directory here. I wanna show you something on the directory. So it comes with a D drive and a C drive. Okay, D drive and C drive. Now the C drive itself is a SSD drive. But let's go ahead and show you in the properties. This is one thing. There's only, um, you know, 118 gigabytes. Notice right here I still have some space left. So what I've done is I've just installed the um, data, most of the things that I have right here on the D drive. And notice there's 931 gigabytes of space there. But you could also very easily put in another upgraded SSD drive. So anyways, this is the review for the Acer Nitro 5 uh, computer with the GTX 1650. I'm telling you, this thing will play anything you throw at it. We have Tom Clancy's Rainbow Six, Battle State Games, Escape from Tarkov. We have Squad, even Arma 3, which is a very intense game, and Insurgency Sandstorm, America's Army. I mean, this thing is absolutely epic. It's very light. Notice it has the dual SIM cards we were talking about for you know memory. It has the narrow bezel, so notice how thin the bezels are on the side, so a lot of people like that. It has the IPS display, so you can see it really from you know either side pretty good. It has Acer NitroSense, we showed you that, which keeps the laptop cool and, and cool boost. And then both of those things keep the laptop cool. And then it even has the Acer Network Optimizer, which is great for you gamers out there. Now, this is a i5. It's not an i7 but it's a ninth generation i5. It's important to know that the ninth generation i5s are faster than some of the previous year's i7s. So I would suggest you get the Acer Nitro 5 uh, laptop. It's awesome. I have had absolutely no problems with it. Um, just, it's just a beast, you know, to run. Any game, it'll run any game on it that that I have thrown at it. So one more time, we're going to start it up. I'm going to count down, and on three, I'm going to push the button. One, one, two, three, and we press the button. And we're already at the login screen that fast, and then I would just enter my password. So. Thanks for watching, you guys. It is a great laptop. I rate this a 5 out of 5.